to plan an event. Okay. I'd like you to imagine that you are planning a wedding. Do you want me to keep that name in? Yeah, sure, that'd be fine. Sorry. Oh, uh, yeah, just put in any old date from now. Oh, it's got to be a Saturday. <laughs> Can we imagine it's happening in um, Holland Park? So what do you think is happening at the moment? Planning the, the elements of the wedding. Okay. So you've got to choose guest list cakes. Or I add them to the things you want to do. So if you want to make it taskless. No, <laughs> don't have to use this phone. Yeah, just click anywhere outside it. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry, you can't change the months, unfortunately. Oh. So is it clear how that would work? Mm, yes. How would it work? I'm assuming it would give you a notification and tell you to, well, it says that. It mm -hmm. goes amber when it's near it, um, based on the date that you've put in, and red when it goes past your latest completion date and you get a notification. Okay. Oh, I might, I might have clicked on the wrong thing. No, it's okay. It's just because um, uh, it's a demo, it only gives you a certain task. Mm. So what do you think happened just now? I created a task to as a, like a notification reminder. Okay. And how would you have a look at that task you just created? Where? Yeah. Okay. You have a look at it. Is it clear to you how this would work? Um, I don't really understand discuss. Um, I don't know if that's who you're discussing it with. Mm. So I don't really know what discuss is. Team is who you're, presumably who you're contacting about. I think it was a wedding cake in this case. Mm -hmm. So you add their contact details. So presumably that's just emails between the two of you. But mm -hmm. I don't really think the word discuss is the most useful. Um, what would be better? Um, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Email correspondence or something, <laughs> but not, not discuss. It doesn't really make sense. Okay. And how would you get back to the main event page from here? So what I want to do is show you what this event would look like after you've been using the app for about 50 days. So just going off of this, what do you think is going on here? Um, apparently we're behind schedule. <laughs> um, got some overdue tasks, some things upcoming. So it's just telling you 
oh, that, sorry, those ones are just telling you what's been done in February, and this is telling you what's sort of due to do now. And that part at the top, how do you think that works? This? Mm -hmm. It's the timeline. So these are task dates that you've got coming up. This is something that was passed, but I'm assuming the X means you've not done it. And how would you see what that was? And Not by clicking on it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm guessing it's in the list. And it's... I don't know. This one. Maybe. Or it's the March one and it's... It was this overdue one. How would you learn more about what's going on with that task? I presume I can click here. If you wanted to send a notification to the people who were kind of involved in this task, how would you do that? Send them an email. Okay. If you wanted to update this task to say, actually, this is done, how would you do that? The edit task. Yeah. Oh, no. Here. Mark but task was complete. The first place you thought to look was edit task. Yeah. If I'd been on the screen, I would have clicked that, but on the different screens, I would go to edit. Mm. 